Welcome to H&B Farm in beautiful Kamloops, British Columbia. So um, the baby goats were born a week ago and we, it went pretty well as you saw from the video, um, but we did happen to have, hi Hannah, we had a bit of a um, concern for Remy, the little girl. She was only about two pounds when she was born um, and she just wasn't advancing. Like through Martin, the little boy, he was bouncing all over the place, uh, having a good time. She just wasn't, she was very weak. Um, we were making sure she was eating, um, which was good. But a few hours, um, I think, no, sorry, it was Friday. Uh, and we noticed that she just wasn't progressing. She had snot in her nose. She had snot in her eyes. So we decided to run her to the vet. Uh, so here's the story. So we're just heading off to the vet with little bitty. She's a little bit phlegmy. So I just want to be safe, but she's a good car companion. The vet said she was very weak uh, and not very likely to make it. Uh, I was devastated and uh, put her in the car, drove home and brought her in the house with a bottle and antibiotics. I gave her an antibiotic injections um, and bottle fed her every two hours. And as you can see, the kids were absolutely thrilled to have a Christmas goat living in the house. I kept this up for 24 hours um, and did start to see an improvement pretty quickly. So I was excited. You did give her a kiss, thank you. I got mermaid. Boo, 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 boo. Maybe she doesn't need mermaid right now. We moved everybody into the basement storage room to make sure they stayed warm in this really cold weather. She just kept getting stronger and stronger. So this is their little pen in the basement, it's super small. Um, you know, it's not ideal, but it's better than them freezing. Um, we're really lucky we've got like a back wine storage, pantry, and then this big concrete room with a walkout area. So it's very separate from the rest of the house. It's pretty warm. Um, and they can just come and go out the door uh, right here. So it's good. Um, again, didn't think I'd have goats in the house, but I want these babies to have the best life and minus 26 when you're a little bit sick is not good. So I clean this out every single day because um, I do not want any smell. Uh, the boxes are on either side to keep the shavings in and so far so good. So it's little Remy's first day outside. She's doing so much better. Um, it was a bit of a touch and go situation there because you're so little but you're doing really really well aren't you? You're very very cute. I'm just taking them for a walk. It's kind of weird. Brandy's on a leash. I know. She doesn't mind. Um, but if I keep her close, then these little guys will follow. And I don't really want them taking off on me. Especially when it's cold um, and I need to get them back in. But I think it's nice to get them out for a little bit of a stroll too. Plus they've literally never been outside. They've only ever just seeing the outdoors from their first stall. We are optimistic Remy's gonna make it. She's doing really, really well. Uh, drinking from mom, temperature's good, and hopping around like a little jumping bean. So fingers crossed and we'll keep watching her. And with that, uh, Merry Christmas everyone from our family to yours. We hope you have a safe Christmas um, and stay healthy. Ah. And we will uh, post another video probably just after Christmas. Okay, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.